Hey, how you doing ladies and gentlemen? So today we're creating this liquid effect on Headphone Express. Okay, I got an idea from this guy on YouTube. Um, go ahead and check it out. He's pretty much doing the same thing uh, that he's working on After Effects. And I thought, we could do this in Headphone. Why not? Uh, I have this uh, file, this composition right here. And there's a lot of things going on, but we're gonna go through those. Um, let's go ahead and create a new file. I'm gonna start by creating a plane. Gonna make it um, small. And we're gonna go transform, click in this little thing over there and the anchor point go up something like this now I'll come back to the scale we're gonna add a keyframe then gonna move forward like two seconds and gonna bring it down to zero and we had this okay Select both of those, open the graph, and click right there, make it smooth, and it's a little adjust. Now, come back to the beginning and play it back. Nice. Now, we're going to import our logo and my bubble. I create this one and uh, hit film so you guys could uh, use it later on. Okay, I uh, bring the logo. <coughs> Put it on top of the um, liquid and let's precompose the liquid. move with the layer now I come back to the main comb I'm gonna rename this one too <coughs> now on the logo we're gonna add s set mat and gonna add liquid this one we're gonna put subtract and alpha and get rid of the liquid turn it off if we play here uh, we have this so what we're gonna do now come back to the liquid and we're gonna add a, a, a preset that I did and hit film just by the control and what it is is a hit distortion so right now it's not doing anything but once we apply a mask we can start seeing the 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 waves <coughs> if we play a bank it's gonna happen if you wanna see if you don't wanna download the preset that I'm gonna provide in the description down below you can just go ahead and copy this is all the settings okay now one more thing we're gonna do we're gonna duplicate this one okay now come back to the main comp now we're gonna fix the logo we're gonna move it a little bit up And like this, turn that off, and there we go. Now we're gonna precompose these two. Color main main logo. Okay, now we're gonna export 
this one I got to sport we're gonna save it right here main logo and we're gonna export when it's done come back to the um, edit and we're gonna import the main logo that we just did go to the main comp and we're gonna bring this one inside okay this is our main logo and this is the logo that we create so this one we're gonna call it um, blue gonna add a this one and pretty much what it's doing is getting rid of all the black background <coughs> okay so let's come back to the blue we're gonna add a fill color and here what we're gonna do we're gonna change the color to something like blue like this and bring it all the way to a hundred and we're gonna add curves and what we're looking here is the alpha and we're gonna increase something like that we're gonna turn off the main comp so we could see so what I'm trying to do is create a solid uh, color like that and let's turn on the main comp and then let's go over here as you can see both of them are play pretty cool huh now what we're gonna do we're gonna duplicate the blue and we're gonna change the color something like light blue Okay, so we're gonna move the main comp a little more. Okay, this one, let's put it a little closer to the first one. And then in the end, it's gonna come the main logo. So we're gonna move forward a little. Okay, we're gonna duplicate the blue one more time and this one we're gonna rename it white and change the color to white and it's gonna put it closer to the main comp it's gonna come up like this nice now we're gonna do another thing we're gonna do we're gonna create plane and we're gonna name it background change the color okay now let's, let's move this thing a little more in the middle like this okay okay now what we're gonna do we're gonna bring the bubbles okay we're gonna bring it and put it on top and what we're gonna do we're gonna change the blending mode to uh and we can start seeing this okay now we're gonna make it a smaller pretty much the size of the logo and we're gonna add a mask
Let's put it in the beginning. Now we're gonna duplicate the bubbles. I'm gonna move it forward. And we're gonna duplicate it one more time and we're gonna put it right on the end. Around here. And we're gonna play it back. And that's what we have. Pretty cool, huh? If we if you guys still see the white line around the edges what you could do go to the main and make it a little bigger and that will fix the problem and now we play it back one more time and that's what we have well thank you for watching guys and I'm gonna provide uh, the bubbles and the uh, and the preset and the description down below so you can use it in your own or create yours. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time.